Welcome back. Today we're talking about freezing tracks to save CPU. Click on Logic Pro X on the top left corner and scroll down to Preferences, then click Advanced Tools. Then click Show Advanced Tools and you'll see a new part of your Logic with various tools and icons come up if it wasn't there already. Next, right click your track header. This might be control and click. Then scroll down to configure track header. The menu will appear and you'll see freeze. Click that option and then you'll see the snowflake appear on your track header. Once you click the freeze icon, you must press the space bar in order for the track to freeze. On this case, we're freezing our MIDI track. It may take a few seconds. At this point, once you check, you'll see that you are unable to change the track. The drop down menu does not appear. Now click the snowflake to unfreeze it. And of course you can change settings accordingly. Freeze it again and you're back to being frozen. At this point, if you try to change a note, a pop-up box will appear asking you if you want to unfreeze the track. Cancel if you don't want to unfreeze it. At this point, everything is frozen. You can't manipulate anything. Once you click down, you'll see that you can change this option, freeze mode, from pre-fader to source only. And now you can change the chain you can't actually change the instrument. If you change it back to pre-fader, nothing else can be edited. Reducing CPU can avoid system overload and interruptions during playback. I hope this is helpful.